as you see it. We've seen significant sell-off in the main crypto assets, whether it be Bitcoin, Ether, Litecoin. Are we at a bottom now? Yeah, I think I think we're close to a bottom at this point. I think the market's essentially range bound and is waiting for some catalysts to pick things back up. Catalysts being? I think there's basically two things right now in cryptocurrency. So all these decentralized applications launched, but they don't really have users yet. And there's two things holding them back. One is these networks aren't scalable. So it's essentially like the internet before dial-up is how fast these networks are, so very slow. And it's also really expensive to get fiat into cryptocurrency today. I think that's going to change a lot over the next six to nine months. So are you looking at companies, startups that are actually solving, first of all, the scalability issue, for example? Yeah, so we've invested in a lot of projects that are trying to solve that problem. It's, it's basically a computer science problem as opposed to, a, you know, on the internet you had to lay down copper wire. Here it's actually just writing programs, which makes it difficult, but a lot easier. Are we close? Because at the moment, what is it? So I'm going to agree with him that, you know, we do have uh, the scalability issue with cryptos. And uh, if you look at this graph, you can see that it's been very stable for now, like three months. And uh, if we hit the bottom, um, it, it's a great opportunity, especially now that the stock market is showing weak signs of weaknesses. Uh, this could be a great uh, position for cryptocurrencies to bounce back and uh, hopefully recover um, back to the all-time highs of 850 billion market cap and possibly break the trillion dollar uh, market cap um, but yeah we're still here at the bottom at 209,000 or 209 billion and uh, it could go lower um, but it's been stable and it really hasn't stayed under 200 billion market cap for any long period of time so if you are thinking of investing in crypto I would highly recommend doing some research, subscribe to the channel, educate yourself, and uh, I think there's a lot of opportunity for growth.